All right, Shalom. First off, I want to give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shah. Double honors to the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone. And the sincere Shalom to all the Akiyam out here that's doing and pushing the work in truth and in sincerity. I want to go on this lesson, you know, um, on my thoughts on Ben Carson referring to the slaves as uh, immigrants. Okay, I'm going to play this uh, quick video, okay? In his first week in President Trump's cabinet, Ben Carson is already making headlines. The Housing and Urban Development Secretary referred to slaves as immigrants. There were other immigrants who came here in the bottom of slave ships, worked even longer, even harder for less. Twitter had a field day with the comments. Chelsea Clinton jumped on the former Republican presidential candidate, saying, this can't be real. Slaves were not and are not immigrants. Another tweeting, they were people forcibly enslaved by other people who denied their humanity. Stop romanticizing human bondage and atrocity. And finally, the NAACP summed it up, saying, immigrants? Carson was confirmed by the Senate on March 2nd. Okay, now... They won't let you know who those people are that was on them slave ships, okay? Um, they were they were Israelites, and the thing is that if you want to get mad at Ben Carson for referring to slaves as immigrants, you also need to be mad at the uh, school system for watering down slavery. You know, not just what they what they um did to the slaves but how they got this land known as uh america they they nearly slaughtered the um the so-called native americans okay um you need to be mad at the school system you need to be mad at um the parents for not teaching about this okay about who the slaves are you need to be mad at the the, the churches especially you people who pick up the bible because the Bible tells you who those people are that, that came on those slave sets. And I'm going to get this scripture. Um, Deuteronomy 28 and 68. And the Lord shall bring thee into Egypt again with ships. By the way whereof I spake unto thee, thou shalt see it no more. Again. Okay. Who else came into to, to bondage with the word Egypt means bondage. Who else went into bondage again with ships. Okay. That's the so-called Israelites, man. Okay, it says, and there thou shalt see it no more again, and there you shall be sold unto your enemies for bondmen and bondwomen, and no man shall buy you. Okay, and what that no man shall buy you mean is no man shall redeem you. Okay, Ben Carson is not no man that can redeem us, okay, from the conditions that we're in. Okay, and they have him signed up as a, a HUD. Housing and Urban Development uh, Secretary, which he can't help us, you know, in the, the law state, especially him saying that the slaves were immigrants. Okay, he can't help the, the, the so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans. Okay, so our people, which are the Israelites, went into to Egypt, okay, with, with slave ships, okay? Now, um, here, here go with it a little bit what he said. It says, Housing and Urban Development uh, Secretary Ben Carson referred to slaves as immigrants while speaking Monday to department employees. That's what America is about. A land of dreams and opportunity. Okay, you, know, you got to be sleeping in order to, to, to dream. Okay, it says, Carson said, there were other immigrants who came here in the bottom of slave ships, worked even longer even harder for less, okay, and that's that's in the scriptures, okay, um, Deuteronomy, um, 28 and 48, therefore shalt, shalt thy, I mean, shalt, shalt thou serve thine enemies which the Lord shall send against you, and hunger, and in thirst, and in nakedness, and in want of all things, and he shall put a yoke of iron upon thy neck, and to have destroyed thee. Okay, um, but they too had a dream that one day their sons, daughters, grandsons, granddaughters, grand, great grandsons, great granddaughters might pursue prosperity and happiness in this land. 
And and that's a lie, man, because when them slaves uh, came over here, okay, they were saying kumbaya, okay, or swing low, sweet chariot, you know, come forth and take me home. They wanted to get the hell up out of here, okay? So um, if you want to get mad at uh, Ben Carson for, for saying this, okay, then you also need to get mad at the churches for not letting you know or reading these scriptures about who we actually are. Okay, and the fact that we're actually um, living under our enemy's rule. Okay, but with that, man, I want to say salawam.